Welcome to the Scribble Squad Hi, podcast. Thank you so much for having me. Oh Can goodness. you tell our audience what your name is and a little bit about yeah. you? Okay, so my name is Erica Diane. You can just call me Erica. No one ever calls me Erica Diane. Got it. Um, I'm 17 years old, going into my senior year in high school, which is crazy. And I've been doing YouTube as my primary like social media platform for over four years now, which is... I, I think almost four years over four years, which is so crazy. And you've grown your audience like incredibly in four oh years. Lord, thank you. Yeah, I, really I love my audience and just like they're like the best people ever. So oh, yeah, I love that. <laughs> so how did you hear about Notability? So I had kind of like heard about them a little bit just through like some of my friends that love like notes, but I had never really downloaded the app until you guys reached out to me. And then I was like, oh my word, I'm missing <laughs> out. This is like such a cool app. Um, so I haven't had like years to perfect like the art of it but I'm so kind of learning how to use the app but I'm super excited to like learn more and I love love like the format and like it's such a cool app. What um, features or like use workflows are you most excited to explore in Notability? You can take connect it to the notes app on your phone and then like you kind of transfer things over I love the notes Drag app. That's like, that's like my number one app besides like all the social media apps. Oh, Notability notes app will be your new note make, app. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited because I make to-do lists every day. I'm like such a huge list person because I'm so, I don't know, like task yeah. oriented like that. Yeah. Now and you so, can organize exactly, your Exactly, now I can make it cute, do like little doodles. So I'm really excited about that feature. The organization is next level. You're going to love it. <laughs> I'm so hyped. I'm <laughs> Obviously you're a student. Um, yeah. Looking forward, do you have any goals for being a better student or mm -hmm. you know your personal um, career related goals that yeah. you'd like to share i'm definitely still figuring it out i don't have it like all perfectly figured out but i no would definitely say just no like <laughs> i want to change my mindset more about learning that's something i've been working on just even this past year in school because it's so easy to be like to just be like oh i'm here and i'm learning and i'm at school especially in high school because that's what i'm currently in yeah. but i'm trying to change it like oh my word this is helping me this is growing my brain like this is helping me get further in life so just mainly just changing my mindset i guess that's so powerful Words learning. <laughs> that's so powerful yeah. that's everything honestly yeah. mindset is everything mm -hmm. do you have any tips for maybe your younger self or other students who um could kind of learn a lesson in changing mindset yeah <laughs> well first of all thinking about your future self and like how this learning is going to benefit your future self because it's so easy just to think about like us now yeah but it's so important to think about like your future self if there is anyone you could give a shout out to to kind of express gratitude for where you are now in your mm -hmm. life who would it be I'm gonna say my mom specifically because she was the one that as far as like education she homeschooled me for the first like nine years of my life wow. so I'm so grateful to her for that like she put in so much work there and then just in like my YouTube career she was the one that really pushed me to start my channel in the first place so I really wouldn't be where I am today without her so shout out mom <laughs> moms are the best yes <laughs> definitely and then what's something that you're excited to learn more about or maybe it could even be a hobby um, that you want to explore in the next year this is so random, but I really want to get good at crocheting. Ooh, like, okay. I see so Wild many card. On TikTok just like making these little like shirts and stuff, and I want to be that person. So crochet. Okay. That's I so random. I see that for you. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then, as a parting gift to our audience, will you tell okay. them what you love most about Notability? I love how many features there are. It's actually insane. Like just going into like all the different colors and all the different like there's like the tape feature love tape. and then like when you press down harder with your pencil it can get gets bigger and like just like all the little details whoever designed this app did an amazing job like shout out to our designers <laughs> amazing amazing job there's so many details and it's such but yet it's easy to use like it's easy to figure out and i love that so yeah thank you for being part thank of our community i'm so excited about this this is hopefully just the first of many more scribble squad yes. podcasts i'm so Woo! excited <laughs>